Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. I had a question from uh, one of my followers. We asked to eliminate theta from the following equation. The first equation in x is equal to a sec theta and y equals to b c cos theta. So we don't want to see theta. Simply put, we don't want to see cos and sec in the next expression so what we can do is let's make sec theta the subject from the first part there are two parts in one question so from here we can say x equals to a sec theta where sec theta is going to be equals to dividing both sides by a that will give you x over what? a. That is if I'm taking this to make uh, sec theta the subject. Then from the second part, which is y equals to b plus c cos of theta. I want to make cos theta the subject. So cos theta will be equals to y subtracting b from both sides, b. But the cos is having C attached, so we divide by C. So now, but still, the first part and the second part still have theta, theta in them. So let's look at what connection in terms of uh, trigonometry identities can we derive from these two. We can see that the sec theta is the inverse or reciprocal of what? Cos theta. In other ways, cos theta is equal to the inverse of what? Sec theta. So whenever I see sec theta in this expression, I replace by what? X over A equals to 1 over cos theta. And where is the cos theta? This is the cos theta representing what? Y minus B all over what? C. I believe this is a double division. So this will go up to multiply. So X over A equal to C over Y minus B become the new expression for this whereby theta is eliminated. So we are only trying to eliminate the, the sec theta and the cos theta. Alright. So in the second example, we can also try to do the same as in try to uh, make tan theta the subject from here. So from x equals to 1 plus tan theta, your tan theta is now going to be eliminating the 1, become x minus 1, 1. Since tan theta has no coefficient, let's just say this is our equation 1. Then looking at this, I'm not sure there's something else to be done again because cos theta is already equals y. So that becomes the second equation. So now our task is to see what connection we have between tan theta and cos theta in terms of for, uh, trigonometry identity. I'll be having tan theta equals to sine theta over cos theta, which in this case, I'll still be having sine theta in my expression. So we go by the identity. Let's say we have sec theta or sec squared theta equals to 1 plus tan square word theta. Where in this case theta is featured, I can see that sec, I already call it cos, is the inverse. You can see if I'm looking for sec, it is the inverse of cos. So even though it is square, I only have to square the value. So it means that this is the inverse of this. Meaning 1 over cos give you sec. So if the sec is square, you square the value you will get. So what I mean is that right here, I will be having... Okay, let me write this one first. Uh, sec theta equals to 1 over cos word theta. But what is cos theta? In this case, will be 1 over what? Y. 
So now whatever I see sec, I put 1 over y. The whole of this square gives me the set square. So here become 1 over y all square equals to 1 plus tan theta or tan square theta or tan theta which is going to be the square of the value of tan theta and that is going to be x minus 1 or what square i can leave it this way i can also try to simplify to any other version this could be 1 over y square equals this if you expand you will still have to have your answer but the goal is that the theta is eliminated so this becomes the final expression for this uh, looking at this i'm sure if i leave this behind for you to try you will be able to provide answer to that making theta and theta the subject making uh cosec theta the subject this is going to be y over b x over a right then you figure out what is the connection between tan and cosec. And cosec is 1 over sine, right? And I can see that there's a, a tan identity. Uh, there's an identity which is what? Cosec square equals 1 plus what? Cot square. Cot is featuring what? Tan. Put that on paper. Let's see what we can get for the elimination of theta from this equations i believe the concept is clear thank you for watching like share and comment don't forget to uh, subscribe if you are new to the channel bye bye